Here comes Thomas! I'm the number one engine, whoa! All engines, go! Look, there's Percy! We're best friends, Max Connor zooms around the bend. I lead by speed and I'm ready to glow. All engines, go! Hey, there's Mia! I'm rocking now. Don't forget me, Thomas! And Diesel gets a shout. Hey! Peter, fix the crew, Carly and Sandy. You can count. Thomas says night before Christmas. It was Christmas Eve on Sodor, and Thomas and his friends were at Knapford Station. Gordon was going to give them their jobs for the day. Twilight was helping out too. Listen up, Benjins. There's a lot to be done before Christmas comes. Percy, I need you to take the clock bell from the docks and take it to Knapford. Okay, Gordon. Anna, I need you to take the Christmas lights to Vickerstown Station. I'm on it, like a comet! Nia, I need you to take the carolers to their concert. Okay, Gordon. And Thomas, you have a very busy day today. I need you to take ice sculptures to Norabai. Then, you must take the giant candy canes to Harwick Station. And last of all, you have to take the inflatable snowman to Eufasted Castle. Okay, Twilight, you can count on the number one engine. Make sure you get your jobs done tonight, engines! Gordon's right, because tomorrow's Christmas and Santa's coming tonight. So Percy went to Burnham Docks to pick up the clock bell. Connor went to Vickerstown with the Christmas lights. Nia took the carolers, and Thomas was very busy on Christmas Eve. Percy had arrived at Knapford with the giant clock bell. Now my job's done, I can go home and get ready for Santa to come. Percy set off for Timmy's sheds and wondering how Thomas was getting on. Thomas had delivered the ice sculptures to Normby and was now spinning to Harwick with the giant candy canes. He couldn't wait to be done, so he could snuggle down in his bed. Meanwhile, back at the sheds, Percy, Nia, Kana, and Diesel were all done for the day. As they went to sleep, Thomas was now on his way to Olmsted to deliver the inflatable snowman. Finally, he arrived. Phew! Job's all done. Now, back to the sheds. He raced as fast as six small wheels carried him. But then, his headlight went out. Oh no, my light went out. I can't see a thing. How am I going to find my way home? Just then, a distance bell rang out. I've heard that sound before. That's Percy's bell, the one he delivered to the clock tower in Nafford. The bell rang again. Only this time, Thomas heard a voice. Now, Thomas, now. Without further delay, go, Thomas, go. Let the bell lead the way. That's it. If I follow the sound of the bell, I will find my way home. But then, he remembered. <gasps> After 12 rings, Santa will arrive. Oh no, that's already 4 rings. I better hurry. And that's what he did. The bell rang a fifth time as Thomas raced into the moonlight. And that was the sixth. I've got to get to Tiffany's shed fast. 
the seventh. Now, Thomas was could see the clock tower at Knapford, and he was almost home at Titmuss Sheds. That was the eighth bell. Thomas wondered if he was going to make it. Suddenly, there come a new sound. Thomas looked up, and to his amazement, he saw a sleigh being pulled by eight reindeer fly across the moon, and there was a jolly man with a giant white beard and a red fluffy hat. Ho, ho, ho! It's Santa! I got pick up some speed! Then the sleigh started to come down from the sky. Oh no, not yet! Then the twelfth bell changed as the sleigh landed on the roof. Thomas stopped a short distance away. He watched Santa jump out of his sleigh and carrying a sack over his shoulder, climb to the ground. Then going one shed door to the next, his single gift in each stocking, Thomas watched as Santa came to his door. He paused. Santa reached into his sack and placed a gift into Thomas's stocking. Thomas was so relieved, he almost yelled with joy. Santa climbed back onto the roof, whereupon he stopped, turned, and looked at Thomas. Thomas froze. Then Santa gave him a wink before jumped into his sleigh gave his reindeer a whistle and flew up away. Thomas heard him exclaimed as he drove out of sight. Merry Christmas to all engines, and to all engines a good night. <laughs> <laughs>